Okay. Hi. This is me, Motsumi, Katrin, Katrin, Kato, Orin. I don't know, whatever name you know of me. This is me. This is my new channel. I am trying to do on YouTube what I used to do in my blog. Maybe 100 years ago, but uh, who cares? I still like the same things and I do have a lot to talk about and I want to share with you. Today um, I'm getting ready for Santa Sun dance, a maid dance actually. It's for a maid cafe I volunteer for on German conventions. Um, yeah, I thought it would be a great idea for a first video to do a get ready with me video. So I will jump to <laughs> my bare face. Well, bare face, I'm wearing contacts and foundation and I'm doing my makeup while I explain what I'm going to do with this channel. So if you want to see me get ready and if you want to know about my person, please stay. Have fun. Okay, let's go. So I already put on foundation and some powder and circle lenses. Not my natural eyes, so yeah, excuse me for looking like an alien. Um, I usually start with my eyebrows. So, to be careful so you can still see my face. Please know that this is not a tutorial at all. I'm not a professional makeup artist. I just like doing makeup. And I thought it would be great to just do a get ready with me video so I can talk and do some stuff I like and you get to know me better. So you might actually wonder why I'm putting the eyeshadow above my eyebrows but they're very tiny and I don't like them being tiny so they need to get bigger. Yeah, you see the difference. Yeah, so I call myself Mutsumi since I don't know how many years, but probably since I am 12 years old, I think. So it all happened when one of my best friends and me, we started getting into manga and anime and we wanted to meet other people that like the stuff that we like so we can talk about it and everyone at those like meetings and even if it was online or in person um, they had nicknames like Japanese nicknames and me and my friend really wanted to do that too so we picked our favorite uh, manga mine was Love Hina back in the day and there was a character called Mutsumi that I really liked. She's really cute. And I picked her name and since then everyone of my friends that likes anime of course calls me Mutsumi. Like recently it changed a little bit and they use my real name a little bit Japaneseified. I don't know it's my name is Katorin but uh, Japanese pronounce it as Kyatorin. So they either call me Kyato or Rin. And yeah so it's either Mutsumi Katonin, Kyato, Orin, simply. Um, just the symbols because it's just R I N. Um, yeah, so that's basically how I came to my name. And I started blogging, and my blog was called Mutsuminism, just like this channel. Um, yeah, it stuck with me. My blog was not very popular, but I think I had quite a few readers, and I did reviews for circle lenses for example for nail stuff I really like doing my nails um, yeah sometimes I posted about Japanese pop culture back then as well I um, posted about fashion Japanese fashion especially around Tokyo um, then I also posted about makeup I posted about my nails um, Sometimes I did cosplay. I'm not a cosplayer. I wouldn't call myself a cosplayer, but I do enjoy doing cosplay sometimes. Um, so yeah, I thought I I just got too busy for my blog when I went to university. 
and yeah, I also went for an internship during my university. My internship was in Tokyo. Um, I was living there for six months and <clears throat> really fell in love with the country even more. I used to only go for holidays and that was my first time staying for more than two or three weeks. And um, yeah, back then I couldn't really speak Japanese, um, but I tried my best to learn it. And yeah, it was a huge advance to of course be in Japan and talk Japanese every day. Um, yeah, after that I started working, but actually only to um, get some money to go back to Japan. Um, I really wanted to do um, a walking holiday. I don't know if, if it's called the same everywhere, but it's like you uh, go abroad for one year and you walk and just be there for one year and um, finance yourself with work. <laughs> Um, so that's what I did and um, I found a pretty good job in Tokyo and um, stayed there for two years. Yes, um, my Japanese of course became way better. I am um, able to talk like daily conversation I would say. I am not fluent at all but um, if someone Japanese talks to me I can, I can reply. I can, I can talk in Japanese and uh, if there's like some Japanese followers, of course I could try to do a video in Japanese as well or if you want to hear me talk in Japanese, I don't know. Yeah, it depends. Um, yeah, I don't know what to do with my makeup, but it needs to be Christmas themed, so I thought green and red would be great. Um, green and red, yeah, there's not too much, too much green. I love red eyeshadow, so I own a lot of red eyeshadow, um, but I don't use green much, there's not even a reason why, but yeah, I just don't use it as much, so I don't own it, <laughs> but I do own Blood Sugar, which is um, an eyeshadow palette for mainly red, and I'm gonna use it today. So when I did my walking holiday in Tokyo, I got to know quite a few people and the job I did was actually for an online shop. Um, we sold uh, anime figures and games mainly, some merchandise of course too, but the main thing was figures and games. Just making sure you can still see my face and I'm not holding these in front of my face. Yeah, as you can see on my brushes, I use a lot of red and it stains the brushes unfortunately, but yeah, not to a degree I cannot use them anymore. So back in the days I was part of a show group as well. I used to perform at anime conventions. I even did the choreography for a few of the dances, a few of our projects. Um, yeah, and I really liked doing it. And I also work uh, on a volunteer basis for a maid cafe um, in Germany at German conventions. And they recently started uh, posting dance videos and we were talking about dancing at the conventions we have our cafe at too. But as you know, this year it's a little bit hard to do events and um, meet people. So it's basically an online thing we do. We record our stands and we edit it together and then yeah, share it on our channels. I felt too shy to uh, record myself dancing and participating in the dances so far, but um, yeah, I'm finally trying. Um, I want to be part of the dance group of my maid cafe and I think I don't suck at dancing. I'm just, yeah, you can see that I'm insecure when I'm dancing um, and I didn't like that, especially because you're recording yourself and then you look at yourself all the time when you're editing it. 
Uh, it will be the same with this video, but I thought I should give it a try. So, yeah, this is why I'm doing this look today. A Santa Christmas made because we're doing a Santa Sun dance. Um, and I just want to look the part and probably I have to use more makeup than I usually do because um, like on the camera you can't really see makeup. Like I put on quite some eyeshadow already but you, I still look like I have a bad face. <laughs> That's not good. So I will simply use more than I used to. Yeah, this does not show in the camera at all. I knew it. Mm -hmm. This is not how you do it. <laughs> okay, I think this looks okay-ish. Um, not as colorful as I wanted it to, but maybe it's the camera, I don't know. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, and actually, let's try putting some on my nose. Yep, some, not too much. <laughs> yeah, great, it looks like I'm bleeding. <laughs> usually don't they don't wear heavy makeup I'm only doing this for the video because I like heavy makeup well not foundation heavy but um, eye heavy <laughs> um, and I'm trying to add some nude lip So I think uh, Yeah, I think I can change Maybe it will look better with a wig and the dress on So, see you in a minute Second And I'm back <laughs> So, I put on the wig I chose a green wig For the Santa team Um Yeah I think my makeup looks alright. I'm not happy with it actually, but yeah, I will go with it. Yeah, it's fine. So, now the only thing left to pick is what am I doing with my head? I put on the made headpiece because it's a must. And now I will either use these. I don't know. Not sure about these. They're cute though. <laughs> or, well, I used to have a Santa hat, but I can't find it. I don't know where I put it. So I will have to do something else. Another great thing I have is this. Maybe. Yeah, 
けど<笑> I <笑> I think it will be the reindeer thing is not not this one even though I love it and I wore it last year yeah no and I need to use hairspray I need to fix this if I have to dance with this wig on I wanted to cut the bangs actually but I'm not sure maybe it looks okay if I wear it like a side bang maybe everything you can hear right now is the bells yeah not falling down and yeah i think i can dance with this okay now let's see if i should do this yeah i think i should <laughs> mm -hmm. okay so yeah I was talking about a few things I did in my life so far and uh, if there was anything you found interesting please let me know and I will talk more about it and um, yeah I would be happy if you keep on watching me if you like this video um, if you subscribe to my channel I will try to upload once a week at least um, yeah there will be everything there will be me getting ready for something I don't know maybe for closet cosplays um yeah because you know this year you're at home all the time it's getting a little boring and i like to play with makeup so maybe let's do this and um also yeah i'm finally looking into the camera and not uh checking myself um yeah so yeah please leave a comment let me know what you want to see uh subscribe to my channel like my channel um share it do whatever you want uh support me <laughs> I would be happy to see a few people watching this and um, if you're interested in anything uh, that I talked about I would love to talk more about it so yeah see you on my next video bye if it won't be too embarrassing I will try to uh, yeah I hit my head um, I will try to put in some dance clips as well <laughs>